Hey everybody, Corporate Rebel here, back with some more Atomic Heart. Uh, last time we uh, beat the shit out of this uh, Yumi-headed motherfucker. And we're going down to kill Petrov. Maybe, I don't know. He died last time, I thought. Anyway. I guess, ooh, she attached his head again. But this time I have a uh, AK of sorts. Fucking watch. Stream of pure energy. So what if she's a robot? People have never been nice to me, but she is. The way she looks at me, it's like there's a stream of pure energy in her eyes. She understands me uh, better than any girl ever has. Anyway, I've made up my mind. I'm proposing to her tomorrow. Oh, no. What the fuck are you doing here, Vasilich? Are you working here or not? Oh, shit, I'm coming. He's going to propose to the robot girl. I believe you can love anybody, but not someone... That's not someone. Ooh. What does this say? We will not surrender. There we go. Answered that question. Yes, I'm guessing you got into a fight with an engineer and it killed you. Good to know. Do we have anything on here? I haven't really looked at these. I mean, I'm sure they provide background, but eh. It's a lot of reading that I don't want to do. Smoking backstage, camera pack away, switch so much. Uh, uh, Robo theater staff. I'm all, I lost a puppy. My sister had this puppy. She got recently to get when my sister died, so I took the puppy. I had a kid. He had a toy, kid stall. He got for my sister. I carried around. Oh, that's sad. Okay. It's wrong. Who's side are you on, mysterious voice from the future? Because apparently that's what they do. Charles, can you track Petrov's yeah, no. whereabouts? Bunch Unfortunately, no. Petrov is no longer broadcasting. I will track him as soon as he does. Gotcha. That means he won't do it again. That dirty, rotten scumfuck is hiding away in some dark corner, and he's gonna sit there and hope the robots kill me before I find him. I ought to warn you that Petrov knows this theater quite well. He has good reason to hope for such an outcome. Hope is dangerous. It'll lull him into a false sense of security. Again, it tells... Mm. How does, he know How does Petrov know this the theater so well? The it was one of the areas his activities so were focused on before he was declared a traitor. So, he's a nostalgic puppet master, huh? He configured and tested the theater's robots, and also programmed and studied the interplay of various crafts. In a certain sense, Collective was born on the stage of this theater. Fun. Uh... Give me intel, Give me intel on the theater. The Maya Plisetskaya Theater was founded at the facility in 1948. It was the first theater in the world to use robots as performers. It is the most famous theater in the Soviet Union, so tickets can be quite hard to come by. So it's for the rich and powerful. So it's for the rich and powerful. <laughs> you have no idea. Before the theater was fully roboticized, party members would order the best ballerinas in the Soviet Union to be transferred here. Of course. But after the performers were replaced with robots, it became so successful, it's now easier to get an apartment near the Kremlin than it is to attend a performance here. Shit. Can you tell me anything more useful and less disgusting? As part of the facility, the theater is without a doubt a scientific establishment. Its artistic vein is melded with commerce, as is the study of robot behavior and human reactions to it. I have no combat-related data. Fun. How'd that prick start working here? He was recommended by Comrade Stockhausen. Oh yeah, no wonder. They're both lousy pieces of shit. Pardon me, but I fail to understand why you put Comrade Stockhausen on the same level as a traitor. Hang on. How'd Petrov manage to butter up Sechenov? Did that lick spittle Stockhausen recommend him to the boss too? Victor Petrov optimized the robot control loading protocols. Data loading speed was tripled. That was when Comrade Stockhausen recommended Petrov to Dr. Sechenov. Hmm. Shouldn't have done that. Well. <laughs> Okay, there Let's go see what's what. No rebuttal to that. All right. Hey, look at save. And I already hear fucking Dan the lion. Saving data. I wonder if this TV is in like every save room. Are they like your cue, comrade major? 
Are you here to finish me off, <laughs> dog? Then come on down. I am all yours. Okay. Are they like telling me what's gonna Just happen? Do one thing for me, okay? Find that crazy son of a bitch and kill him. Deal? Sure. You killed so many innocent people. Oh. Okay. I thought you were talking about Please. someone else. I'll find him and kill him. You can You can take me as a conversation partner. Ah, oh, good. If the robots are just uh, so weird, so fucking weird. Tell that you've been without a woman for too long, Major. How may I entertain you? Jesus Christ. There's a safe room in there. So great. They're all You're funny. like a dog. Your master sticks you on someone and you go right for the throat. <laughs> Just do me a favor. And do it. Torch, okay? What is that? Ooh, the hole is electrified. It's a trap. Son of a bitch! I'm still gonna get you! Hang on, comrade major. I'll try to reduce the charge. I don't care if I got a crow. I'm gonna get that motherfucker. So the robots are fighting the I've reduced zombie the charge. Plants. Are you okay, comrade major? Had worse, much worse. He's not getting away from me. All right then. Can you in here? Again. Ah, I found an energy module. I don't remember what those are used for. I have plenty of health. I'm good. Uh, oh, let's just go back, okay. Oh, now I go through the horny ballerina room. So I'm guessing... I'm dying to find out. I see you. That was really fucking easy. I stay. You have fun. You can you can have that room. I don't want to. I don't want. You, it's yours. That room's yours. I don't want to deal with the fucking engineer bots. Is there another way to go? I feel like there's another way to go. Is there not? Yeah, I'm just crazy. Alright, cool. Well. Hey, engineer buddy. I fought a lot of stuff. You were by far the most terrifying. Please come closer. I would love it if you left me alone. Can we, can we do that? Can you just leave me alone? What are you weak to? Shock and ice. I'm gonna leave you alone. If you leave me alone. Promise? Okay. Leave me alone. Uh, had some fun once. Good. You can keep having that shit. You make me hit this engineer robot, I'm like, be so pissed off. So nice. So nice. Good, good engineer. Good little cleany bot. Don't murder me. Those things are fucking hard to kill. Oh, there's something in there. Uh, do I get them there? Through there. How do I get... Sneaky secrets. This makes me wonder how many of these I've missed. Probably a lot. Which is very upsetting. Boop. A tuba. Dead tuba player. How did you die? There's nothing in here. Bullets. 
Lots of bullets, good lord. Okay. Let's get to the third floor, shall we? Make sure all my guns are loaded. Oops, stand up. Thank you. There's saves like every 20 feet. I don't need another one. I tried to tell them. There we go. I hear the noise on the other side. Alright, so we got blue. There we go. Who cares about those ballerinas? I'm the star. They usually sell loops on stuff like this. Where do guys like Petrov even come from in a flourishing society like ours? Oh shit. Wrong button. Welcome to our mind blowing show. Ah, oh, fuck. It's this thing. Fucking hell, I hate these things. Alright, first things first. Take care of the zombies. Ow, fuck, 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 fuck. I don't need to be dealing with these end zombies. Ow, fuck! Fuck off, you prick! Fucking hell. Oh, God. That was really annoying. I hate those things so much. Oop. Sorry. Sorry, my bad. A lot of shit to loot, though. A lot of neuropolymer and biomaterials. You bet I can't loot some of these. There we go. I don't know how I'm gonna loot that one. I like how it says I can. You can loot me. Just hit F. From 500 feet away. Is there a way to like increase my loot range? Probably not. All right. See, I was thinking this was gonna be one of those big mutant zombies. Not that thing. I fucking hate those things. Here. All right. Cool. Go through the vent. Blue needs to be a opposite. Too far. Not far enough. There we go. Those I like. Those are easy. I can do those. I hate the timing ones. I have terrible timing. Have you found Petrov's trail, Comrade Major? I've driven him into a trap. He's got nowhere to run. Is Dr. Filatova with him? No, Petrov's alone. Aren't you maybe just a little too interested in what happens to her, Stock? You didn't happen to betray your friend because of her, did you? You just crossed a line, Major P3. Oh, did you? I demand that you cease these outrageous insults at once. So, and I demand right. that you shut up and stop annoying me with your pointless existence. I am carrying out the order of Dr. Sechenov. Yeah. Dmitry Sergeyevich wants to know when you deliver Petrov to him. Your protege has nowhere to run. He's gone nuts. He's watching me through the cameras, reciting poetry, and screaming hysterically into the loudspeaker. I'll take him alive within the hour. Try not to fail, Dmitry Sergeyevich, at least this time. Fuck you. Okay. Kill Stockhausen you shouldn't at any behave point. like this. Comrade Stockhausen is blameless. He is genuinely trying to help. Yeah, right. He's genuinely trying to steal Petrov's woman. I'm very confused about Glove's motivation. He's trying to betray Sechino because he keeps telling me like, oh no, maybe Sechino's not. Uh, and you're like, well, okay. But he's super on Stockhausen's side and but against Petrov, I don't know. All right, uh, what are we looking at? 
green, green, red. All right, so splitter needs to go here. No, wait, I'm stupid. Put that down, that down, there. Fucking hell. Oh. Sorry, buddy. I mean, not really, but, you know, I'll pretend to be. Oh, this one, okay. Dandelions. Judge not, lest ye be judged. Look around you and see the lies for what they are, or the truth will catch you unawares. You hear me, dog? Mine was not the original sin. It all started with such not. Okay. I was just an unsuspecting victim. How? Why are these all posed like this? The mad clown at the wedding. I'm not reading all of these, but I'll read some of them. Well, apparently not that one. safe room, so I'm assuming I'm going to come from that way. Alright, well, let's go down the stairs. Or the elevator. Elevator works too. Or we'll jump! <laughs> Fuck it! You miserable dog! I will show you the duality of this world! It's all a matter of perspective, isn't it, P3? Do you decide what to do? Or is it decided for you? It doesn't matter which side you see things from. Top or bottom. Left. Right. You brainless mutt. You'll never understand. Pieces. I thought I did. There we go. <laughs> Need to find one of those candles. There's a chicken. Hi, chicken. All right, so we got two ways to play. We'll go this way. Already closer. Alright, we're gonna go the other way, because I think I like that way better. There's two chickens! And save. Charles. Yes, Major. Uh. Say, are the ballerinas here? Just ballerinas. The topic of <laughs> robosexuality is Not extremely popular among no the Soviet gonna kill me. Robosexual lobbies have become quite powerful. And it would seem that the sale of related services is flourishing at the theater. Yes, In other right. words, no. The ballerinas are not just ballerinas. Cool. Do you think the boss knows about this? What Probably. do you think? Well, 
given the robots he's chosen as bodyguards, guess he's a robosexual himself. According to Ozhigov's dictionary of the Russian language, the word robosexual is a facetious term for a person who enjoys intimate relations with machines, generally while manipulating... Okay, yeah, I get no, it. I get he can go ahead and manipulate whatever he wants. What he does with those androids of his is none of my business. But I gotta admit, they are kind of hot. <laughs> they are kind of hot. All right. Petrov's lost his shit. Right. Following an analysis of Petrov in light of his recent quarrel with Larissa Filatova, I have drawn the same conclusion. You analyzed him? It's a common scenario. He loved her. Their perspectives on life grew apart. See. She ended the relationship. He lost his mind. Huh. Makes sense, I guess. Yeah, fair enough. What kinds of shows do they put on here? Primarily ballet. A performance entitled Heart of the Robot, A Peaceful Atom, has been particularly popular recently. Mm, keep hearing a about that. A celebratory performance is planned here in honor of the launch of Collective 2.0. Space-based programs honoring the first Soviet citizen in space will come later. Yeah. We'll see. Cool. This place is pretty messed up right now. All of fucking Russia's pretty messed up. Stand down for now. Hush. What? 